Yo, what's up, YouTube? Um, it's just me. Um, I haven't made a video. I'm still alive. Sorry about that. Um, we got lots of new snakes, big updates, even got eggs. Um, I also got a new rack. This is a vision rack. Holds up to ten. I use it for my adults. Um, right now I have five adults in there. Uh, my two males are down here. This is my male, male candy cane. Hopefully you can see him pretty well. He just, he shed uh, about a uh, half a week ago, so, hopefully that picks up the color pretty well. It's also feeding day, so, every Thursday. My lavender, my male lavender, he's about to, sh he's about ready to shed. Hiding in the back there. I'm going to try to zoom out so you can see it better. And, uh, all my females are up on the higher racks. Um, this female just laid on the 5th, so she's still pretty skinny. Um, normal het for a male. Um, probably not very good do the camera, sorry if the color's bad, but uh, she's getting fed, also looks like she's getting, she's almost ready to shed, she didn't, she didn't have a pre-lay shed, so, um, these two females, I'm waiting to go lay eggs, I don't really want to disturb them too much, but uh, just one of my MLs, I've had her for a while, And here's another female ML when she's on the move. Um, I got her from Don Soden Soderberg, South Mountain Reptiles. Um, I bought her as an adult female. Um, I bought her as a surplus snake, so I'm just going to assume that she probably wasn't the best uh, egg layer. Just because that's usually what surplus snakes are. They're not always, always the finest quality, but... I'm hoping, anyhow, over to the eggs, uh, just use my hub baiter. Um, I like it, it doesn't seem to be holding the humidity well enough, as you can see the eggs in there, there's 13. Um, all, the, all the ones below the soil, pretty much, are perfect, um, but the ones on top are a little bit deflated, more deflated than I want to. Right now I have it at 85.4, with an 87 de uh, degree uh, humidity. Um, all the corns over there, okay. Also, I bought two baby racks. Uh, the other one's ever at my house. And, uh, uh give me a second. Let me just wash my hands real quick. Be right back. Alright. Sorry about that. Now, I'll show you all the babies I got. Um, I went to, uh, a reptile show on the 25th down at Hamburg, Pennsylvania, and I picked up this male opal, let's see if I can get him, he's only, uh, he was only fed on fed live, and I got him onto, uh, frozen thawed, pretty much, I just gotta trick him into it, I can't, I, every time I try to uh, get a picture of him, his color always comes out wrong, so I'm hoping I can get him right here, on the camera, let's see if I can put him next to something. There we go, it's color starting to show. Get him closer. Hang on. He'll bolt on me if I let him go. I'm trying to hold the camera and the snake at the same time, not always the easiest. But, uh, it's my opal, hopefully it, you can I, so you can see his color. Probably not, though. Got a little bit of pattern, delay checkers, whatever. And got him. There we go. Sorry about that, little dude. Not happy about being held. I also picked up, while I was there, I traded my hog nose away. And I got a baby female hypo lavender. There she is. It's feeding day. Um, she's getting ready to shed, so you probably can't see her too well, so, uh, Let's see if I can get her attention. 
real quick. Here we go. Use the big tongs. Let's see, where's the smaller mouse I had ready for? Right here. Alrighty. Hang on. Let's see if I can get her attention real quick. There you go. Mmm, nice and juicy. And I picked up, actually, these came in the mail on Tuesday from a guy named Walter Smith. Um, you from uh, Corn Snake Forums all know him pretty well. These are Normals he Hypo Sunkissed Amels. I got a 1.2 pair of them. They're very nice. Um, I haven't fed them yet, so today's going to be their first feeding day. Hopefully they all eat well. Really pretty. Pretty bright for just being their normal selves. I like that. And here are the females. Hanging all back there. They're all, that's, uh, probably not the best quality, but... There you go. And the last female, down here. They all like hiding in their little corners, right back there. And uh, that's just a little bit of an update. I'm waiting on, the, like I said, two females to drop their eggs. Right now, the only eggs I have, 13 eggs I have right now are for my uh, female normal head of male. So, and that's 13 eggs, so they're gonna, they're gonna come out normal het lavenders with a 50% chance to be het amel. So I can create opals with them, and I'm waiting for the two amels to drop their eggs, which will be normals, het lavender, het amel. So, hopefully they'll all give good clutches, and, excuse me. I also have to go to my mother's school and, uh, do a, uh, school presentation for all the third graders. I do a reptile presentation for free, I show them all my snakes, you know, have a good time about it, maybe I might film it, or have somebody film it for me, so, they can all see it. And there's my doom rolls back there, just chilling. My male's gonna come with me to the show, and there's the female. And, um, that's the update, um, hope you like everything, the rack and whatnot, and this is Reptile Kyle, and I'm out.